I'm Fraser. And I'm Rue. And we're going to do an energy assessment of this home. My name is Sia. I live in a three bedroomed detached house built in the 1970s with my daughter. What we're going to do today is I'm going to sort of sit with you for the, sort of the next 10 15 minutes and we're going to go through how you use the property, mm -hmm. how you eat property, how you use electricity in the property and just sort of get a feel for that. I think Ruth's going to go off and do some measurements and as part of this we're also going to use thermal imaging yes. to try and expose some of the inefficiencies in the property. It's difficult for me because I don't have the expert knowledge of how to put it together, what's best for this house in this particular position and in the way that we use it. have a look in this loft space to see whether there's any insulation above because it also extends over the porch and if there's no insulation it could be drawing out heat from the rest of the house. Now switch the fan on. So we've set up the blower door test and we're going to start sucking air out of the property, depressurising it, and we're going to find where all of the cold air is making its way into the property. Basically, the dark blue bits are where you've got colder, colder air coming through, so you can see that all the darker bits are around the joins where we've sealed off the, uh, the fireplace. So, um, so that's the cold, probably the cold air trying to come in through those seals as we've depressurised the house. Oh, look there, and it's really bad. Yeah. They need a seal down here as well. That's just some simple draft proofing mm. strips. 100 mil of insulation, but it's been put down over some older insulation. It's just, and there's loads of gaps. So that's coming through the fabric of the building outside, and you know, so some simple. What, through the back here? Yeah, through the back, straight outside. Or it's finding that's its way through. That's extraordinary. Also, coming up the middle. Well. Yeah, it could be coming from, so what you want to do is if you can just seal that, so literally with yeah. some silicone, okay. then that will stop air infiltration through into this. All right. And so, you know, all of this is about so your boiler doesn't have to work as hard. Mm. So we've completed the home energy assessment for this householder, and we think there are four major things that they can do. Number one, they can fill the cavities in their walls. Number two, they can properly draft proof the windows and the doors. Number three, they can replace their old heating system with a modern energy efficient one. And number four, they can insulate the loft with 300 millimetres of loft insulation. Together, we think these can save the homeowner about 30% on their energy bills a year. 